Welcome to the Nightcap. It's your girl, Carolina Sanchez. Happy Thanksgiving Eve, baby. Woo! We're going to have fun tonight. Yes, yes, we are. People are at home cooking. Yep. Prepping for all this drama. Yes. yes. But good eating that's going to happen. That's right. And a lot of drinking. Come on a now. A lot of drinking. And actually, B, What's you up? brought me and Latrice uh, some treats, right? I did. I'm okay. excited. Yes. Okay, so first up, y'all know, normally around Thanksgiving time, you either bring dessert or you bring alcohol, right? Okay. Yes. Yes. What if we combine the two? What y'all mm. got to say about that? Now, that sounds dessert. really good. Drink dessert. I I'm curious. Dessert yes. beer. I'm curious. I'm curious. All right, let's try it out. So we have five different brands. Okay. Five different flavors. Let's mm. go. All right, y'all ready? So let me pop this thing open. Oh, it's a twist. Just a top. Baby, just simple. We okay. like simplicity. Yes. Uh -uh. yes, yes, yes. All right, so first up, Carolyn, right. we're going to give you a nice little po. That's good, that's good. Oh, that's good. I just want to make sure I give you enough so you can try it. Ooh, yes. This all looks right. good already. All righty. Okay, y'all. All right, cheers. Yingling cheers. with Hershey's. Cheers. Let's do this. Okay, Yingling, it's okay. a thing. It's a thing. Okay, it's good. Okay. Verona can. Hey. If it was colder. If it was yeah, colder. I would yes. definitely like it a lot more. But you know what? That's our fault. It wasn't colder, it, right? We yeah. had to have it chilled or good enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So but we didn't give it I time would, to really do is, you that know. That was my only, that it's was my only. Cold. Yeah, I right. like that. I could drink that. Mm, I can't Ice cold. Let's, yeah. put it, let's put it back. Good. On, okay. Yeah, let's put it back on. Yeah, we might finish that. All right. Have a good one. All right. So Verona can. Latrice can. Carolina can. Boom. All right. Next up, we have this one. Y'all, these names are so good. This is Happy Holla Delicious. Happy okay. Holla Delicious, y'all. Okay. And this one has what the salted caramel. Ooh. This is Saloon Dua. Saloon Dua. Ooh. Right. That's sounds right. it's nice. Salted caramel what? Yeah, it's salted caramel Russian Imperial Stouts. Ooh. Bam. Okay. okay. All right. I love so we're going to pop that thing open. We're going to see what, what it do. All right. Let's Another see if the brew really going to do what it do. Mm -hmm. Ooh. This, yeah, this is really yeah, dark. Yeah, this is dark. I hope it don't taste like cigarette butts. <laughs> <laughs> That's a callback. I know. Call okay. Back. Okay. All right. Cheers. 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 Ooh. All right, y'all. Let's see. Mm -mm. Can we? That can smell. We? Mm mm. Mm mm. Oh no. I no 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 no. I'm trying, y'all. Give me a second. I can't. Verona can't. It's a little bit too tart. Right? It doesn't have like a... Girl, it I is cigarette know. butts is no, what that is. No, it's tart. Mm. It tastes like I really put Carolina, tart. that's like cigarette butts. For <laughs> real. Oh, no. That was... <laughs> Verona can, but it's tart. What? I'm you can't. I 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 can not i can not it's they salt can't. and caramel. No. Uh-uh. Mm. I'm, I mean, I'm saying. about to shoot this like it's a bad shot at the club. <laughs> not the club. Well, Latrice can not at all. <laughs> all right, oh, next no. up, y'all, we have, let me see, put my hat to the side. Pretzel Stout, limited release peanut butter. Y'all oh, like peanut this butter? Sounds I mean, interesting. I love Martin House Brewing Company. Yeah. Who made this? Yes, Martin House. I haven't House. tried this. Okay. I, I love their sour beers. Okay. Now I don't know about their stouts. All right, Martin House. I need y'all to impress Carolina. Happens. She says she like y'all brand. So Martin House. Oh, All right, please let's see what take you do. That, that last is flavor it. out of our mouth. <laughs> <laughs> The cigarette but don't make yeah, the it worse. Don't make it worse. Like, All right, like, cheers, okay, ladies. Cheers, ladies. Bam. All right, here we go. Martin House. Let's see. Ooh, Verona can't. Ooh. Okay, it's definitely better than the last it's one. It's better than the last one. I don't one like this one either. But mm -mm. the first one is my winner so far. Verona can't. The first one, yeah, that's definitely one for me. Like, two. if there was nothing else to drink and I really wanted to drink something, I wouldn't mind this. I wouldn't really? mind. Really? So you're pleased with the Martin House. Okay. Mm. I'm kind of indifferent. Yeah. Verona can't. Right. Carolina, yeah. maybe. Latrice, nah. maybe. Mm. Maybe, maybe not. Nah. Nah. nah, maybe not. Nah. All right, maybe let's nah. see what we got next, y'all. Ooh, Pit Pat chocolate peanut butter. And this is from Porter. Mm. That's okay. Okay. It's giving me like a chocolate milk look yeah. to it, right? Mm. So let's hope it tastes like chocolate milk. I know. I think it's the, the brand ooh, is ooh, Pit Bubble, Pat. bubble, bubble. Let me go ahead and pour. Ooh. Okay. All righty. All right, let's Here do we go. this, ladies. Cheers. Cheers. And this I feel like I'm making a chocolate milk, peanut trying to get this. So this should be like a Reese's, right? I'm going to let you say first. It's got no flavor. Ugh, Verona can. Ugh, no. There's no flavor. Mm -mm. I'm going to let this last one to rescue me from this taste. 
Oh, Ooh. we're going back to the first one. Oh, yeah, that first one was hidden. I don't mind this one because it's just so light. I mean, it might as well be like the Miller Lite of stouts. Mm. Yeah. Mm. There's no, there's nothing. It's giving me almost a, a cigarette butt. What is this? It's just you can't cigarette butt again. A cigarette butt again. Uh-uh, mm. I don't like that one. I, Latrice, what say you? I don't like it. You don't like these? I'm sorry, y'all. Latrice y can't. I cannot. All right, on, last Carolina. one, y'all. Ooh, honey, they got a Ninja Turtle on here. Teenage Mutant. Okay, Ninja Shell Turtles. Shock. Ooh, Shell Shock. Okay, oh. Imperial Stout with pecans, fudge, caramel, and vanilla. Now, this I'm excited about. Okay, you said that Shell Shock. Good. Are y'all really going to shock us with I a mean, good taste? I like so. He's snarky and, mm -hmm. and sarcastic. Yes. So hopefully, you know, he comes through. Just the fact that it has pecans and vanilla and right? caramel, I'm excited. All things Thanksgiving, right? Okay. I feel like I'm making a mess, y'all. I mean, it's you know, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving it gets good. messy. It gets messy for Thanksgiving. Really okay, does. here we go, y'all. All right, cheers. all right, cheers. cheers. I've been thinking bunga. about right. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking about Donatello. He was my crush for the turtles. Okay, go. Okay. Mm. Mm -mm. Donatello. Mm -mm. Ooh, Donatello ate your man tonight. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh-uh. Wait. -uh. I can't even process the drink. Uh-uh. Because she said she had a crush on Donatello. Donatello with the purple band? Yeah, what yes, about Donatello. about Michelangelo? He was all right. They was all up on him like that. I was he, like, uh-uh. Donatello, I mean, he know, was. he really did his thing, though. He did, but Donatello, he knew what it But this right here, I don't, I, I'm sorry, Papa. Can't rock with that. <laughs> mm -mm. No, Veronica can't. Okay, I can't with this. <laughs> yeah, I'm with Veronica. I can't. And Carolina, get yourself together. <laughs> Carolina can or can't. I know we haven't even we haven't even heard what she got to say about Donatello and who. <laughs> she can't even drink it. Let's just do one for I'm Carolina. Trying, I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. Do you think she liked it? I think she liked it because she's more. She finished already. <laughs> like, let's see. I mean, it's 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 giving, but not enough. Yeah, yeah. it's dead now. I would say the Yingling. Yingling was the best. Hershey sure. is the winner. Yingling. This would be my Hershey's. number two. This would be my number two. So good, y'all did that. Yeah, that was good. All right, well, you should pour us up a little bit more. Just a, to a little wash, wash out. everything out. I got y'all. Now, if I can do that, you at home, you don't like beer or anything like that. We actually had some liquor options for you. I Ooh. had Ed come bring the Ed experience, and he made a beverage based on what I had in the fridge. So, see if you can make something too. Coming up next. Mmm, that's good. It's Ed Warner with the Ed Experience. Oh, whoa. Well. Listen, I did not plan for anything. Can you make something out of something we found in the fridge? Mm hmm. Huh. Challenge accepted. Let's go. The first drink that you could make could be real simple. Let's make a holiday highball. Ooh, a holiday highball. So we're going to put some ice in a glass. Mm hmm. Does so ice matter? Ice always matters. Okay. Um, I got some of my levels of grandeur burnt cassis. Hey. So I'm going to put a little bit of that in glass to start. Okay. Ooh, that is about, thick. About a quarter of an ounce. Ooh. And just because I'm going to use one of the seltzers and they're usually not very sweet. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to get a nice bourbon. Ooh. Tonight I'm going to use Russell's. 10 year old. Okay. I'm gonna rinse out something you always think about. If you use a jigger and you're measuring, get get your first ingredient out of there. So I'm gonna add one, two ounces of bourbon. Yeah, because you know, it's how we do it tonight, Cap. Because on Wednesdays, it's what? It's, it's Blackout it's, Wednesday. It's the day after, uh, the day before Thanksgiving. Oh, now, prepare for the shenanigans that yes. are Thanksgiving. Public service announcement, don't ever black out. Okay. Don't get blackout don't drunk. Don't do that. So what I'm gonna add to this, spice the spice that. apple, and give it a stir. Oh, and it's nice and foamy. Okay, that's an easy drink. You literally just there you go. that with what we got. Boom, okay. right there. I'm trying it though. Okay, Nitra, you don't drink. Correct. Mm -hmm. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make you a highball. 
I'm gonna again use my burnt sugar as a sweetening agent. Okay. And should you always put a sweetening agent in first? Well, what you should do when you're building your cocktails mm -hmm. is build it from the cheapest ingredient to the most expensive ingredient. Interesting. All right. Because, okay, I'm gonna do it with the double shot. Mm -hmm. You drink coffee? Yeah. Now let's say, after I did that, I realized, uh-oh, I'm supposed to put something else. Mm -hmm. Well, if the whiskey's in there, I just lost the whiskey. Oh. All right, so I'm gonna stir this up to get it, to get it a little flavor profile. I'm gonna add an odd ingredient that you may not think about with coffee, a little bit of coconut, because the coconut tends to bring the floral notes out of coffee. Ooh. And then, I'm gonna stick with the apple. Okay. And I'm gonna just... Splash. A splash, just to give it some effervescence and to sort of play with your, play with the... Palette. The palette and just have fun in your tongue. All right, here it is. What do you think about them? Oh, I love mine, but cheers. Ooh, the coconut really... It's coming through? Yeah, the coconut really sets it off. Like, mm. it has like the, a mild coffee. I can taste the original, the, what was this again? It's a burnt cassis syrup. Yeah. Now normally, if we were gonna say, Ed, make me coffee drinks, well then I would brew coffee. Right, but we you didn't know, have that. But it's what we had this in the is what we had in the fridge. You know, another thing that you got in the fridge, I'm gonna put a little bit of um, pineapple, pineapple juice. juice, and this one, I'm going straight mad scientist. You notice I'm not measuring nothing. A little bit of coconut. I mean, I feel like that's how we all are. We aren't bartenders, right? right? We just right. pull it up. This is where it gets a little crazy. I'm gonna add about a half an ounce of mezcal, an ounce of rum. Mezcal and rum? I don't think I've had any cocktails that mix both of those liquors. Have you ever had the Ed Experience? The Ed Experience, the Ed Experience. I was trying to stay hello, away from that. Hello, hello, hello. I was trying to stay so away make the Ed from that question. In your house. Oh. So now, there you go. Ooh, ooh, that mezcal. Oh, that's nice, it's sweet, but it's got, it's got the mezcal smoky bite. Mmm, that is a true inter, what, intoxi intoxicated allergist? Intox okay. Intoxicologist. Let me make it real simple. I'm a bespoke cocktail designer. Ooh. Bada bing, bada boom. That's the Ed experience for you. Period. You probably won't be bespoke cocktail designer at home, but he taught you a little tricks that maybe you can pull out before the family comes over and makes you crazy. Welcome back to the nightcap. You know, Ed, he already walked us through how to get that liquor going with what we got in the fridge. Yes. But uh, let's say Grandma says, you gotta bring a dish over <laughs> at the last minute, like right now, she's calling you. Well, you gotta figure out what's in your fridge yes. at this point. At this so point. So Latrice, you know, chef extraordinaire, baker extraordinaire. Thank you. What, what, what you making, what you find in your fridge? I'm making what I call chin southern beans, which is a recipe from my dad. He's been oh. making it forever. And it's super simple. Like you literally can make this from anything you have in your fridge. It's ground beef or ground turkey. I use ground turkey. A little bit of seasonings, which I'm gonna show you guys what seasonings I use. Do not steal my seasoning recipe. Only you on the nightcap get to yeah, Spirit. only the nightcap, okay? I'm only gonna do this for Carolina because I love you guys. <laughs> You've already started. I have. During the break, while people were watching Ed, you were. Yes, you so were. I don't, you know, I know we don't have any, any patience nowadays, so I went ahead and got started. And this is just a little bit of butter that I let saute. And that butter and, smells mm, good up in here, right? And does. then my seasoning blend, which is onions, bell peppers, a little bit of jalapeno, nothing too spicy. Mm -hmm. Deceive the jalapeno so it's not spicy. And then my ground turkey. And now you my season. Yes, my goodies of seasoning. So basil leaves, kosher salt, a little Goya adobo, cayenne pepper, ground black pepper. I know this seems like a lot, but it's all worth it. Trust me. Ground cumin, white ground pepper, Mrs. Dash, of course. Southwest Chipotle, garlic powder, paprika. Oh, my you little, the whole I did my quick uh, Cajun seasoning, and last but not least, a little bit of Worcestershire sauce because it goes a long way. Trust me. What? Yes. Wow. Oh wait, I got you. So curious. You think I'm it smells right? good in here right now? Wait until and I. There's, yeah, there's no yes, seasoning. Know, right? This, and there's no seasoning. Oh my God. So, okay, you a chef. It That's is right. what it is. She's doing I mean, what we learn. She's taking us exactly. To school right now. I typically eat it with rice. 
um, or cornbread, which I made some honey butter cornbread mm. you guys are gonna love. What? Yes, ma'am. Mm. Honey, honey butter. Honey butter cornbread. Honey cornbread's already, Right, you know. uh-huh. Add some honey. That's right, baby. And yes. I always say I'm cornbread fed, so. Hmm. You know, this is the South. Uh, this is this Texas. South. We yes. love our cornbread. Exactly, we do. That's why these hips are wide over here. <laughs> <laughs> these hips don't lie. Listen to me. I'm trying to get my hips. Girl. It's not working, y'all. It's not working. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm so curious about this Worcestershire sauce. Yes. Worcestershire. Yes. Worcestershire. 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 Everybody try to say Worcestershire. 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 So what I did was, I honestly, I just shake like maybe three or four times in there. You don't want a lot. If you right. were asking me to measure, I would say a tablespoon. Yeah. But that's it. It's just to give it a little bit of extra flavor. Flavor, it's mm -hmm. not to overpower the meat at all. Yeah, okay. for all these cooking tips. I know, okay, I'm, I'm like, ready. Ooh. I'm ready. I'm trying to get Fox to give me my own cooking show. Oh! And so then, <laughs> once you let this cook a little more, I'm also gonna add just a can of fire roasted tomatoes. Okay. And, and y'all got y'all got a can of tomatoes, tomatoes at, at the house. Exactly. Pantry, right? And it doesn't have to be fire roasted. If you just have diced tomatoes at right. home, like that's still fine too. Mm -hmm. I just like fire roasted. It gives it an extra. Yeah. Ooh, we yeah. are cooking it up on the nightcap, aren't we? Yes. So we how are. spicy is this dish? Honestly, not spicy at all. Even though I put cayenne pepper in there, it literally has like to me no spice. If you oh, think it's gonna be spicy, so yeah. We don't if know. You think Right. it's gonna be spicy, I would just take out the cayenne and use everything else. Got okay. it, okay. Even the fire roasted. Yeah, the fire roasted tomatoes aren't spicy at all. They're yeah. honestly just tomatoes like you put in a pan and you blanch them until they get like a little bit of like char on them, mm -hmm. but it has no spice. Oh, that's right, it's fire roasted tomato. Yeah. yeah. It's not um, combined with any So it's usually like a little kick. Yeah. Yeah, okay. That burnt, that burnt flavor. Mm. And then just mix it all together. Mm. I usually let it simmer for maybe five or ten minutes before I add the beans into there. Okay. But so we with are hungry. the magic of television. Yes, and we're hungry now. And we are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and add these right now. Okay. And then we're gonna get to this pan that I pre-made that is already done, All so right. we can eat. Yes. Right now. Mm. Oh, I love mm. ranch style beans. Oh my God, and cornbread. And is this is this the way to go? The ranch yes, style. if you're gonna use um, beans in a can, ranch style pinto beans are definitely yes. the way to go. I suggest the black and red can. That I don't is know my the favorite company, but we've been using these since I was a kid. And Me this too. Is, I swear by them. Yeah, and they're inexpensive. They too. are. Right. It was like a dollar a can or something like yeah. that. So it's not something that's gonna. Nothing. Break the bank, and, right. you know, if you're on a budget. Okay, I'm telling you. that didn't work. I feel like you can make so many meals just out of that. You know, you got your turkey meat, you got beans, thing, you got tomatoes, a... right? Yeah, so and, and that's the thing, it's so it. simple. Like, yeah. this is literally something everybody's gonna have in their house, in their pantries, in their right. freezer. That's amazing. All right, well, Ooh. when we come back, we're gonna dive into it. Yes. We're gonna give her an honest review, but I can tell by the way this smells, it's gonna be good. It's, it's gonna be good, you around. Oh, oh, you caught me right before I was going to take a bite of I the know. delicious chintz southern beans. Mmm. Oh. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Thank you. Veronica Thank can, Veronica. Oh, Veronica can. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Oh, my God. Wow. Thank you. I mean, it's not spicy, so but it's got good. that kick. good. That kick, right? Yes. Mm. You I get the did that award, honey. Thank you. You oh. did that. Thank uh, you so much. This is so good. Thank you so much. Mm. And that was so simple. Mm -hmm. So, like, listen. If you are really scrambling mm. tomorrow or tonight, yes, she hooked you up. This is Quick the way easy. to go. I'm, I'm actually gonna just make this on a regular Tuesday. Yeah, you know that's especially yeah. now, like it's cold here mm. for however last long that lasts. Right. So, like, this is a great winter dish. Yes, like, wow. it's so good. And as you said, with some rice. Mm -hmm. Yes, right. I'm gonna say y'all haven't even tried the cornbread yet. Oh, mm. I'm trying it right now. Mm. Mm. All right, and it's cornbread honey butter, butter, honey butter cornbread. All right. This is the truth, y'all. So good, so delicious, powerful taste, flavorful. Mm hmm It checks all my boxes. Mm. Mm. It's so good. Mm. It's delicious. Mm-mm. <laughs> mm-mm. Mm -mm. oh, literally. Girl, you think that's fire. Mm-mm. I've tried. It's mm -mm. delicious. Veronica can, 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 can honey. Can, can, can. Okay. Uh, We're here. Ten times across the board. Yes. Happy Friendsgiving. Mm. You gave us the delightful. I did. Uh, dessert flavored beers. Yes. yes. Some were delightful, some were not. Some were not. Exactly. <laughs> but Latrice, from what you, you got in through. your pantry, 
You came all the good. way thank you, thank you, through. Thank you. This is amazing. Tears yes. across the board, ladies Woo-hoo. and gentlemen. Tears across the board. Great forager episode. Yes. yes. I love mm-hmm. this. This is exactly what I need you right now. You can figure it out. You can have a good time on things. Yes. Right? Yeah, mm-hmm. for sure. Like, you yeah. just bring the good vibes. Mm-hmm. Or bring the good drink, because um, you may need it. <laughs> yes. Cheers. 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 This is good. All right, ladies. Well, I hope you all have a happy Thanksgiving. Well, thank yes, you, you too. too. The well. Friendsgiving was off the charts. Yes, yes, it was. I had a great time. Yes. But sometimes you got to have a Friendsgiving before you have the family Thanksgiving. Yes, yes exactly. Because we're probably going to have one after mine, too. Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> for sure. Cheers, y'all. Happy Cheers. Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. We'll Cheers. Time. So good. Girl, this is fire. I'm Girl, this is thank so you. amazing. Oh, so good. Thank Girl. you.